Hey y'all, I'm back with another video and this is Vlogmas Day 11. Y'all, I am, I'm tired. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do Vlogmas all the way till Christmas. I'm going to keep trying though, but I'm not feeling hopeful. Because <clears throat> uh, it's just hard trying to upload every day. But right now I'm sitting here. You see, I got on my my Scrooge hat. That's what I call it. Cause I'm feeling a little Scroogey, you know. Not feeling in a holiday spirit at this moment, you know. Move, no, move, move, move. I'm just not, you know. Mainly, of course, because I miss my baby, and it's just not the same no more. It's not. I was sitting here. And we have this elf on the shelf. And let me tell you why I have the elf on the shelf. Well, for those who know, uh, I used to work in childcare. Actually, me and Dacia, we worked together. Uh, and I enjoyed it. Like, I really enjoyed it. We got to meet a lot of good people. Man, I came across a lot of, like, just really cool kids that a lot of them we still keep in touch with today. Uh, man, that was an experience. I do miss the kids, though. But I don't think I'll ever work in that field again. But never say never, right? Uh... But we had got an elf on the shelf for the kids in the class. And, of course, Kai, uh, I don't care how old Kai got, like, he still was a, a kid at heart. And he would always tell us, when when you going to bring that elf home? And he was excited to move the elf and to do the elf on the shelf. So, you know, so now it means... A lot more than what it meant you know when we had it before so I just keep the tradition going and you know and I bought this this elf on the shelf kit Nova Go outside uh, see, it's just a kit for you know to I guess move the elf about but if you're a kid, don't watch the video because I just spoiled it for you. But uh, anywho, yeah, Kai would be so excited to to play with the elf. Y'all, you know, it's uh, I still can't believe my baby is not here. I just have no words. I would give up everything, anything, everything to go back to when Kai was here. Man, because we are, you know, we are family, we are close family. We Man, holidays was our thing. I don't care if we didn't have like the money to get certain stuff for holidays. Or I remember one Easter, um, you know, we always got them like the baskets and the egg hunts, and and even if we couldn't go to the big old egg hunts at the parks, we did it right at our house. And if it was raining outside, we would hide it, you know, throughout the house and have them go look for it. I mean, we just, every holiday, that's not one holiday that we hadn't decorated or did something. <clears throat> so to be doing Christmas night and not have Kai here, y'all, it's, 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 look, I can't even, I can't even begin to tell you what that feels like. But I try to stay positive, you know. 
and and just celebrate his life, you know, celebrate the best way I know how. Let's say that. And then to know that like we got family coming for the first time, y'all. We've we've spent holidays with family, but never to the point where my family is coming to my house. Like Kai would have been so excited. So excited. You know, because he's a huge fan of my sister. You know. I remember the last time we went to see her. <sighs> he didn't want to leave. You know, he cried in the car. But, alright, I'm going to... Um... Yeah, I'm not going to make this a sad video, y'all, because, you know, it's Christmas time. But I just want to let everybody know, man, we we think we have time. We do not have time. You know, spend time with your loved ones. Tell them you love them. Even if they get on your nerves. You know, never pass up a, a opportunity to make a memory. Because today could be your last day. It could be my last day. So to my family, I love y'all. Even if I don't talk to you, even if, you know, we're not as close as we used to, you know, I wish all my family well, you know. But, yeah, y'all, but I'm trying to you know, just find things to do. Of course, we're going to be doing the gingerbread. The gingerbread houses. Uh, of course, Garcia bought two more. Because Kyron wants to do a gingerbread now. But instead of her just getting one gingerbread. She got him a tree house. And I forget what the other one is. But y'all are seeing in the next vlog. But y'all, what, what are we going to do with all I mean, it's fun. Of course, last time we did gingerbread with Kai, his house looked at a mess, y'all. It really looked at a mess. But he had fun doing it. He had ice and all on his hand. And uh, and I remember saying, boo, that looks a mess. And he'll say something like, no, it doesn't. Or he'll laugh. <sighs> all right. But, yeah, y'all, look. The... the the little gingerbread, you got a chair, look. Look at that. You got a little chair. But of course, you know, I'm gonna put my own spin on it. You know, I've been seeing some some ideas on TikTok. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and do some of those. But yeah, y'all. But uh and I think we're gonna try to do some uh banana braid. Cause we got some bananas that's just sitting and going bad. Like Kyra likes bananas, but I think Darcia do a little much when she make the order. You know, he said he wants some bananas. He didn't say hit the tree. So we always have extra bananas, and they they sit and they tend to go bad. So Darcia says she's gonna make some uh, banana bread. Now, do she know how to make banana bread? I've never known how to make banana bread, but I will say she'll be said finding a recipe and she will file it to the T because she make these lemon pies, y'all. I think she's going to make some for Christmas, but I'm not sure. But, uh, nah, this is a little secret, y'all. Darcia got these pies from her sister. Don't tell I told you. Shh. But she kind of added her own little whatever to it. And now they're the Darcia pies. And I remember one time I was trying to help her. You know, just help her crack the egg. And just, when I say you have to follow it to a T, she don't want you to so much, like, whisk the eggs more than maybe two or three times. Like, if you go maybe four or five to her, you done messed up the whole pie. Like, throw the whole pie away. It's done. 
it's done. I'm like, girl, it's an egg. And then you can't leave it in the oven like no longer than, let's say, a minute or two, maybe three. I think it's five minutes, but I'm not a baker, so I don't know. But I know if you, let's say it's five minutes and you leave it in there six minutes, you didn't ruin the pie. So, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, figure out what I'm going to eat today or if I'm going to cook something. You ever, you ever get up and you, you want to eat everything, but you don't know what you want? Because I swear we eat the same thing over and over and over and over. And of course, chicken is like 90% of that, that, that meal. Wings, fried wings, wings and gravy. You know, so I need to do something. I still got some jalapenos. I love stuffed jalapenos. I just hate making it. You know, you gotta. And I, oh, I got some gloves this time, y'all, because last time I did jalapenos, I, you know, didn't have no gloves. And after I finished, you know, you're supposed to wash your hand. A lot of people say wash it in milk or let it soak, soak in milk, whatever it is. But I touched my eye and I was nothing good. Yeah, so here's a tip for you if you got jalapenos on your fingers, don't touch nothing on your body. Don't touch your eyes. Don't look. Look. Take it from me. Wash your hand. Make sure it's off. Put it in milk. Do whatever you got to do because you will regret it. But that's my tip. My Christmas tip for the day. Oh, let me show y'all. Uh, Kyron is turning 21, y'all. 21. I can remember when we just brought Kyron home from the hospital. Y'all, Kyron was a little baby. Kyron, Kyron was almost the size of this elf. I'm not even kidding you. He was little. And he would not eat. He would not do nothing. And he had to stay in the hospital, so we had to leave him. Now, of course, we went back, you know, we didn't abandon him. But he wouldn't eat nothing. Now, he like a little Pac-Man, you know. Sorry, Tank. But uh, <clears throat> but he don't like peanut butter though. I don't know why. No doctor never told us he was allergic to it, but he just he he don't like peanut butter at all. He don't like the smell of it. He don't eat M and M's. I don't even care if it's the M and M that don't have the nuts in it. It smells too much like peanut butter, and he don't eat it. Let me tell y'all a, a, a funny story about Kyron, y'all. Uh, when Kyron was a baby, of course, you know, he don't like peanut butter. And he didn't like brown nipples. Now, let me explain. Uh, you know, like when you get the baby bottle, it has the, you know, clear nipples, you know. I mean, back in the day, they probably had brown nipples, but I don't know about all that. But I know they have the, the clear nipples, right? That's what he was used to. So, one day we was in the store and I saw... Uh, it was a brown nipple that went a, a nook or whatever it was. I forget what it was, but I know it was brown. I think it was a nook. No, it was extra nipples for the bottle. That's what it was. So we get home and we like, uh, you know, put that on. Uh, and we put it by his mouth. Y'all, he gagged. He gagged. I don't even think Karen was one yet. I don't even think he was six months. But he gagged on the brown nipple. <laughs> Like, as soon as you put it by his mouth, he was like, Ugh. and I was like, I just thought of something, you know, I was like, Duh. I sure hope he don't, you know, ever find somebody who got brown nipples. Okay, this is not for kids. This content is not for kids, but you get what I'm saying. But yeah, y'all, Kyron, Kyron is 21. He'll be 21, y'all. And that's here got these little these numbers that light up. Okay. Got this one too. If is, is this 21? I don't know how y'all see it on the camera, but yep, Karen to be 21, y'all. I can't believe it. That's my tanker butt. That's what we call him, y'all. For everybody who, you know. Watching my videos, uh, we call Kyron Tanker Butt 
we called, well, I particularly don't call Dorian a uh, doe, but a lot of people call him doe. Uh, the Seal family calls him Dodie. I don't. I can't stand the name. But, uh, and we call Kai Boo. Yeah. We used to call Kai Wawa because he was a wild baby. Somehow, Wawa went from Boo and now we call him Boo. It used to be Boo Boo, but then we shortened it to Boo. And he was okay with that. Now, Kyron, don't you call him Tanker out in public because. But every time Doran come, like when Doran come home, Doran go, hey, Tanky. Like, it's funny because we still act like Kyron is a baby. You know, he used to it, though. I think he figured, like, at this point, they're not going to stop. So we I might as well just deal with it. But, yeah, y'all, I'm just rambling on. Just rambling, 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 rambling. Y'all, we taking Christmas pictures, y'all. Like Doran is taking pictures. That's his that's his new hobby now. You know, taking pictures and he he does good. Like he do some really good pictures. So me and Dusty used to take pictures all the time. But after Kai, you know, it's kinda weird. I I feel like I haven't found myself. I haven't got back to that person I was before everything happened with Kai so I guess I'm trying to find my way back but uh yeah mm, so yeah y'all that's my little rant rant for the day yeah but wait let's talk about y'all what are y'all eating for Christmas like what's on the menu now normally, normally for us, like tradition, we would do like maybe gumbo, um, stuffed bell peppers, macaroni, you know, stuff like that, right? Kind of like Thanksgiving food, but you may add greens to it. You may add, you know, just a little twist, but you know you do gumbo for Christmas. But I don't know if I want that. I'm, I'm not sure, y'all. Like with family coming over, we got some family members that want steak. Uh, other ones saying party food. Um, I'm thinking like a jambalaya pasta, maybe some some chicken. Now this is the thing: I don't mind chicken in the jambalaya, but y'all, who wants to sit there and fry like almost forty, fifty pieces of chicken? And the way my family eat, then you might as well triple that. Ooh. Who gonna fry that much chicken? And I wonder if they got a place that'll be open that you can just get chicken. Cause I I don't know. I'll make the pasta, but I don't know about frying all that chicken. So we don't know. We'll see. But yeah. Oh, and we're doing breakfast food for Kyron. For Kyron's birthday, we're gonna be doing breakfast food. <laughs> Cause it's like normally Christmas Eve we uh cook. You know, listen to music, you know, cook the night before. That's really when you spend time with family and you do all the little things and play games and stuff like that. But that's also Kyra's birthday. So he wanted breakfast. Now, I'm trying to add a little twist to it, like maybe do like a shrimp and grits. Maybe some f shrimp uh, fish and grits. You know, of course, bacon biscuits, eggs, that type of stuff. So, we don't know. But that's pretty much what we got so far. Yeah. Oh, and my sister, of course, loves hot sausage. Hot, sauce, hot sausage. I, that's crazy. I can't even say hot sausage. But uh, if you're from New Orleans, then you know. It don't matter how you say it. Hot sausage, hot sausage, whatever. And you go to that corner store and you order you some uh, uh, hot sausage poor boy, then you know. <clears throat> but my son, go, darn, gonna be bringing some hot sausage from New Orleans. Uh, oh, and some pig, pig lips. Pig lips. 
Comment down below if y'all eat pig lips. The pickled pig lip. I love pig feet, pig lips. Like, but I was talking to my little nephew. Hey, Chris. Shout out to Chris. Uh, he, uh, he never had pig lip. Which is crazy because his mama, like, literally eats that type of stuff all the time. But uh, he also don't like tuna fish, so I guess I see why he never ate pig lips because he don't like tuna fish and stuff like that. Uh, but he going to taste a pig lip for the first time, y'all. For the first time. I love it. I'm not even kidding you. You get a bag of chips with that pig lip. But he asked me, have you ever eaten it on a sandwich? And I did tell him I never had it on a sandwich. But I lied. I was talking to Dustin last night and I said I kind of did eat it with a sandwich one time. Like I had made a sandwich. It wasn't like particularly on the sandwich, but what's the difference, right? If I'm eating a sandwich and then biting a piece of the pig lip. So it's kind of like, you know, but I, I did eat it together. And it's, it's good. I'm telling you, don't take my word for it, y'all. Go get you a, a pig lip, make you a sandwich, get you some chips. You'll thank me later. So, all right, y'all, that's enough ranting. I didn't talk and talk and talk. And y'all, I can talk and talk and talk some more. And I'll probably be back later to talk some more on top of some more. Oh, Lord, here come Nova. Y'all, mind you, her hair starting to grow back. Which I like how she look when her hair grow back. But she don't let you comb it, brush it. She don't want you to do nothing to it. And it's like when she go outside and she come back inside, that, that outside smell just sticks to her. And then she want to come lay up under you, like sit, it's just, she stank. But I got some uh, baking soda type of, you know, dog, dog spray uh, that's coming today. So we'll see if that works. And her appointment to get groomed is after Christmas. So I wonder if I can get it pushed up. I'm going to have to see to get a cut because Nova is a lot. She's a sweet baby. Yeah. But, all right, y'all. So, I'm going to go ahead and finish doing what I'm doing. And I'll be back a little later. Who knows, y'all? We just have to wait and see because who knows what can happen. I might go for a ride. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, but uh, we'll be back. All right, y'all. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and close out this vlog. Uh, day 11 of Vlogmas is a wrap. Hope y'all enjoyed my story time. Uh, and I'll see y'all tomorrow in the next video. Y'all be blessed. Peace. All right.